I have to go see him today. I want to see what he wants to talk about. It's a bit of a strange one. That's all I know. Ah, here I am. Uh, near his house. He, he lives, uh... Whoa, this place is confusing. I think he lives down this way. Oh, that's his house here. Woo! Pop, pop. Pop, pop, are you in here? Oh, there he is down there. What's he doing all the way down there? Hey, pop. It's me, baby duck. Amelia was asking for you. She, she, she has actually been acting a bit strange, though, since you said that, kid. I've noticed a few really strange things. Uh, 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 is that the news you wanted to tell me about? Is that why you called me all the way over here, pop? Oh, I guess I have to. There's no way I can't tell him. Um, ba baby duck, uh, since we've become so close, I think it's your right to know. Uh, you know, since... Well, on the day you were born, baby duck, you uh, your mum gave birth to you. You were the most beautiful little baby in the world. Oh, my goodness. You were so handsome. You were so funny. Oh, you didn't cry a peep. But then, baby duck, something crazy happened. Your mum your mom gave birth to another baby. Uh, baby duck, uh, th this is how I have to tell you, but uh, you've got a twin brother. Oh, <gasps> uh, you... For serious, Pop? I'm sorry, Baby Duck, but we, we've got no information about your brother. It, it's a bit like you. We, we don't know where he is. We don't know his name. We don't even know what he's doing. I cannot believe it. I have a twin brother? Oh, what do I do, Baby Duck? What do you do with this information now, huh? Oh, gosh, I... Should I go look for him or should I get desperate dad to look for him? I think it calls for a meeting with Jeff or maybe the police stay. Oh gosh, baby, look, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Uh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Me and Jeff still aren't really supposed to be meeting each other, that's for sure. I have to go. I have to go sort something out. I need to get this. I need to find him. I need to find exactly who he is, what he is, and how he smells. No, wait. I don't think I want to know how he smells. Well... I'm sure he smells like me, only a little bit different. Um, probably he does. Actually, I'm guessing that's exactly how he smells. Oh, gosh, I, I think I need to ring Desperate Dano. Phone! Phone, where are you? Oh, gosh, baby, look, not this nonsense again. Why don't you put your phone in the one place? Just pick a place. That's where your phone goes. Every time you come home, that's where your phone is. You have broke 17 phones now. Do you know that? You broke 17 phones all because you keep putting them in the fridge. This is ridiculous, baby duck. Oh, good. Wait, it's probably a... It's not in the fridge, is it? Oh, if it's in the fridge, I'm gonna be... No, it's not in the fridge. Not in the fridge at all. Oh, gosh, okay. Maybe it's up here in this box. I really hope it is. Is it here? Is it in here? Please let it be in here. It is... Yeah, yeah, it's here, it's here. We got it. I've got this phone up. So excited. This is the best news ever. I'm gonna meet my twin brother. Well, actually, just because I found my phone doesn't mean I'm gonna. <laughs> Hello? Hey, Desperate Dad, what's going on? It's Baby Duck. No, you know, Baby Duck. Oh, Desperate Dad, why do we go through this all the time? You know it's me. Whoa. Whoa, are you serious? You really? You had pork tacos? How was that? Yeah, that sounds pretty crazy. Poor tacos? Oh, what? No! No, that's bad. I'm ringing it for a reason. No, I've got some issues. No, no, no. Why did you say bless you? I didn't sniff. No, desperate dad. I don't have tissues. I have issues. Okay, okay. No, desperate dad. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Guess what? My pop told me I've got a twin brother. I know! There's two baby ducks in the world. Well, I, I don't know what his name is or what he goes by. It, it could be baby duck. I don't know. I don't know! Desperate Dan, you need to settle down. I don't know. Look, uh, look, Desperate Dan, I'm gonna go meet Jeff soon, but can you just, can you just try find something out about this, please? Can you do something for me here? Okay, thank you. You look into it. Oh, goodness, that Desperate Dan is ridiculous. He's so difficult to meet up with. Uh, 
I gotta meet Jeff. I gotta... Oh, gosh, I don't know where I gotta meet him. I'll text him and I'll meet him somewhere, but it, it has to be soon. It has to be real soon. I gotta get going. I, I wanna meet my brother. Oh, this will be amazing. Okay, okay. Maybe I can meet him at the police station or something. I'll text him. I'll text him and I'll meet him there. But come on, baby. Look, let's go meet Jeff because you got to try to figure out who your twin brother is. You gotta make sure he doesn't smell or look like you. Come on, baby duck. Why is it he always insists on meeting in the weirdest places ever, huh? Who wants to meet in a graveyard? What a freak of nature. Oh, gosh, baby, look, this is creepy. I don't think you should be here, right? Oh, no, no, why don't we just bring Jeff and, and cancel it? You, you don't know your brother. You've never met him. You don't want to meet him that bad, baby duck, do you? Oh, oh, gosh, oh, yes, you do. Who am I kidding? You're dying to meet your li your twin brother. Hey, hey, I wonder who's older. I wonder if I'm older than him or if he's older than me. Oh, if he's older than me, he'll never let me live it down. And I, I wonder what his name is, though. Maybe his name is Baby Duck as well. Oh gosh, let me open this. Oh, oh, they sound super creepy. Oh, Jeff! Jeff, where are you? Why does he want to meet in these places? What a creepy, weird guy. Jeff, where are you? Oh, Jeffrey! Jeffrey! Mm, Jeff? Hello? Jeff? Where are you down here? Oh my gosh, this is... This is an underground tunnel, Baby Duck. Oh, wow. Oh, this is just... Oh, it leads, it leads out. Oh my goodness, that, that leads underneath the, oh, this is too creepy. This, oh, Jeff, there you, no, oh, that's a scarecrow. Oh, baby duck, how could you get Jeff and a scarecrow mixed up, huh? Although they kind of do have the similar haircuts and stupid scarfs and nobody really likes them. You know, I haven't had Jeff, Jeff say he has any friends or nothing. I don't even know if Jeff has friends. Maybe he does, maybe he doesn't, but he certainly hasn't. Oh, there he is, uh, Jeff. Jeff, hey, buddy, what's going on? Whoo, Jeff, why do you always insist on meeting in these creepy places, man? What's going on? This is too weird. Ah, baby duck, these places are just safer. Well, it, well, last time we got here, actually, it, it wasn't safe at all. It was completely the opposite of safe, you know, it was... It was pretty bad, actually, last time we were here. But that was only because your mother was here, who, who, by the way, is doing really well. Thanks for asking, kid. Oh, hey, while we're on the subject of your mother, how is she keeping? What, what's she doing? Is she, oh, gosh, baby, duck, how, how is she keeping it? How, 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 I know how she keep, but how, how's your pop keep it? How, how did he react to the news that your mom is gonna be okay, huh? Oh, Jeff, that was pretty crazy. He, he actually took it really well. He was really happy that my mom's okay. You know, uh, he, he, he's having actually a really tough time with his new wife or girlfriend. Uh, no, she's his wife. She's definitely his wife. She's been really suspicious and, uh, he found red, red liquid in the in 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 the in a big barrel in the garage and then they also guess what happened to this one he also remember there was red liquid put in my mom for the food poison so that's not good but yeah he was so happy jeff uh, he was over the moon and hey i'm glad my mom is okay that's the main thing oh gosh i can't wait to meet her hey is there any update on when i'm gonna meet her jeff uh, i'm really excited to meet her and I kind of want it to be soon, you know. Oh, kid, it's going to have to be another few days before you meet her, but that's really strange about your mom and that red liquid, you know. That's that's a bit unusual. I don't know if I like that, baby. Duck. That's very, very weird. It's one of the weirdest things I've ever heard. Like, why, why did she have the red liquid like that in a barrel? Hmm. I'm gonna need to investigate that. That's not something we're gonna be taking lightly here. That's something that I'm gonna have to look into. Of, of, of course, if you don't mind, kid. That That is only if you don't mind us looking into that. Mm, I don't like it at all. So, kid, what was the reason you called me out here in the rain? You said you've got super exciting news and you need to, you need to meet me and you need, you need my information and all. So what... 
What? Why did you call me out here, kid? What? What's this all about? What's the big idea here, huh? Oh my goodness, Jeff! I completely forgot to tell you! Yeah, I dragged you all the way here. Um, Jeff, I was speaking to my papa and he found out I was gonna be meeting my mom soon, so he decided to tell me something. He said that I have a twin brother! I know! Hold your excitement then, Jeffy boy! Isn't it that just the best news you've ever heard in your whole entire life? Isn't it just amazing? I'm super excited, I know. A twin brother. I don't know what I'm going to do with myself. But yeah, so, uh, Jeff, what I kind of need you to do is... I already have Desperate Dan looking at the case. I kind of need you to look, see if you can find out any information about any brother of mine. Or anyone who may be my brother. My, my pop said he doesn't know anything, so... If he doesn't know anything about him, well, then I'm guessing my mom doesn't know anything about him. So, I don't know. Could you get some of your investigators or something to look into for me? Please, please. It would mean the world to me. It would mean I can find my mom, my dad, and my twin brother all at the same time. Oh, it would just be the most amazing thing in the world. Please, Jeff, can you help me? Whoa, kid. That's big news. Wow, C -c congratulations, I guess. Uh, yeah, sure, I can help you. Uh, kid, uh, your mom obviously doesn't know anything because she's never said nothing to me about any of this. So, uh, yeah, your mom doesn't know a thing, baby duck, okay? So, maybe I'm going to keep this a secret from her just for a moment. Well, she obviously knows she has a kid, but hey, I'll get my investigators on it and we'll see what we can do, I. I think you should be able to find him, but kid, you're gonna have to hold tight till tomorrow, okay? That's, that's all I'm gonna say to you. I can't find any information for you till tomorrow, alright, kid? Oh, yeah, that's fine, Jeff. I'm not expecting you to do anything today. Gosh, it's ready to get hot, everything. Well, you do what you can do, and I'll talk to you tomorrow, okay? You send me an old text on the phone, okay? Thanks, Jeff. I'm, I'm gonna get out of here, because it is raining a lot, so I'll see you soon, buddy. Oh, goodness, the excitement is killing me. I think that maybe, just maybe, I'm gonna find my brother. I'm no, I can't go out that way. I can't. I can't be breaking the graveyard. Goodness, that's that's a terrible thing to be doing, breaking the graveyard. Oh gosh, maybe I could go to the police station because maybe they have some information on on the whereabouts of my brother. I I'd say they do. Ooh, ooh I can find out if they, he has an address or anything. Oh, that would be just the most amazing thing in the world. Come on, baby, let's go to the police station, see if we can find your brother. Oh, well, at least the rain has stopped, and I'm here. That didn't take me long at all. You know, the police station and the graveyard are quite close to each other. Coincidence, I don't think so, if you ask me. But I better go in it. I just want to ask for some information on my brother. Hello? 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 Hey, 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 Mr. Police Officer, how you getting on? It's Baby Ducker. I haven't been here in a while. It's good to see you guys. Yes, yes, I'm keeping good. You're looking good. We're all doing great. Hey, okay, Mr. Police Officer, I'm gonna cut to the chase here, mister. I kind of have some information that I want you to know about. Well, actually, I have a twin brother. Yep, my pop told me I have a twin brother. So I don't guess there's any records or anything you guys can check in your little filing cabinets there that can tell you any information about my brother. Or if anyone in the back room can run it through their computer so they can see any information. You know, my mom and my dad know nothing about him. I don't know an address. I know nothing. <laughs> well, uh... Oh, I know nothing. I get that. I get it. Well, I do know stuff, but just nothing about my brother. So is there anything at all you guys might be able to muster up, officer? Why, hey, baby duck, what's going on? Good to see you again. Hey, I'm glad I heard about your mom that you, you kind of saved the day with everything. So, uh, congratulations, buddy. I'm, I'm proud of you. You really did save the day there with your mom. That's really good news. Congratulations. Uh, oh, whoa, and, uh, well, you got a brother. That's, a uh, that, that, that's an, an enormous news, baby. Okay, again, uh, congratulations, I guess. There's not more to say to that, but, uh, so, baby, look, what, what the, what kind of information do you want us to get? I, 
I guess we can run your name through the computer. See, see if we can find anybody related. But I, I wouldn't hold my breath if I was you, kid. Okay. Uh, maybe you should try that desperate Dan guy. See, see what he can come up with. But uh, I'll, I'll have a look now, and uh, we'll see what we can get. Okay, kid. Oh, officer, that would be amazing! That would make me super, super happy. Oh, you're the best officer in the world. You know what? I don't care what they say about you, officer. You're absolutely amazing. So you go run that through your computer or whatever, and you get back to me. I'm just gonna sit gently over here. Oh, baby duck, you're about to get information about your twin brother. This is so cool. I wonder what his name is. I hope his name is a baby duck. Oh, his name is probably Davy Duck or something. Oh, hey, that's a pretty cool name. I, I'd say that is his name, but I'll wait here till we're ready. I've been sitting here for so long. I've been twiddling my thumbs, singing some musicals. Oh, gosh, this is a disaster. What is going on here? Hey, mister, what is all this about him? Have you guys run anything through the computers? Have you even bothered looking? Oh, mister, you've just sat on your big stinky butt all day not even looking, haven't you? Oh, I'm sick of this. This is ridiculous. You know what, mister? I'm not even gonna ask you if you have anything. Actually, baby duck, I, I was just about to call you. Uh, we had to do a couple of searches, you know. We wanted to make sure we were right. Look, baby, that we searched your name. There's nothing anything says about a brother. Are you sure you have a brother, baby duck? Because I really don't think you do, kid. We usually would have something in our system, you know. You should be microchipped and that, so we'd be able to tell if you have a brother at a hospital would say if, if your mom gave birth to two kids rather than one. But nothing is said, baby duck. I... Oh, gosh, kid, I don't know how to tell you this, but I I, I don't think you have a brother. I'm sorry, baby duck. I, I really am. I don't think you have one. Oh, gosh, Mr. Police Officer, that's the worst news I've ever heard, but I guess I'll have to go with it. Oh, that's terrible, but not to worry, Police Officer. Hey, thank you very much for trying. I appreciate it and all the help for with my mama. Thanks for everything, Mr. Officer. Oh, goodness. I'm gonna ring Desperate Dan and tell him to cancel the search that I don't have a brother. It was all just a hoax. Why would my dad say that? Hello? Hey, Desperate Dan, what's going on? Yep, baby, don't get... No, no, you know... No, I don't I don't care what kind of tacos you had today. I really... I'm not in the mood. What? Desperate Dan, you can cancel that search for my brother. Uh, I was at the police station asking if... Asking if I have one and... Uh, if I have a brother and... I don't. They, they told me I don't. I'm... So, yeah, Desperate Dan, you can cancel everything that, that you look for. What? Really? Nah, you're messing. You're gonna text me the address? Well, t t thanks, Desperate Dan. I gotta go over there immediately. Make sure you text it to me right away, okay? Thanks, Dan. Oh, goodness, Dan. Dan said that my brother he, 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 he is a real thing, and, and he has an address. He's gonna text it to me. Oh, gosh, baby, look, let, let's go to your brother's house. This is super exciting. I think I'm here. These are the directions. Let me check my phone. Yeah, you said, uh, no, it's just past these, and it's, yeah, the global apartments. Oh, goodness, this, this area doesn't look very nice. It, it looks a little bit rough, if you ask me. Uh, let me go in. There's nothing in here. What? What is going on? Oh, oh my goodness, what, what, what is this place? This is like a little rec room or something. No, no. Wait a second, so this is where my brother lives? Oh gosh, this is, this is disgusting. I, I was, oh, this is horrible. He, I was told he lives in apartment three, but no, no, wait, I wasn't. I think it's apartment one he lives in. I think it's apartment one. I, I, I hope it's apartment one. Where, where is apartment one? Oh, yeah, this is it. Uh, this is it? This is where my brother lives? What? Oh, gosh, I thought my brother would have been better than this, but no, how wrong was I? Yuck, this place is disgusting. Where am I? Ooh, what is going on around here? Yuck. Okay, well, uh, my brother didn't seem to be in. Maybe, 
Maybe I could ring a uh, desperate Dan. Or... Wait, I'm, I'm actually gonna ring Jeff. Hey, hello, Jeff. Hey, what's going on, buddy? Yep, uh, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Uh, I'm just at my brother's apartment. Yeah, yeah, I found the address. Wait, you found it as well? Oh, that's great. Now, desperate Dan, tell me, but this place is disgusting. My brother is a weird, weird guy. What? Well, well, well we have wrong addresses. What? Oh, that's what I get for listening to Desperate Dan. Oh, my goodness. Uh, okay, Jeff, I'll meet you soon with the uh, proper Jesse. Okay, okay, I'll be home in a second. You chill the beans, buddy. No, oh, I'm home. I've done so much traveling around today. All in one day. Ah, oh, this is ridiculous. Baby Duck is not best pleased with this. Let me tell you for sure and for why. Oh, wait. Well, I gotta meet Jeff. He's, he's probably at the back garden where he always is. That is that is typical Jeff. Chilling at the back garden, not doing anything. It's what he always does best. Okay, okay. Let me, let me have a look around here. Okay, where could he be? Jeff! Jeff, are you out? Oh, Jeff isn't here. This is ridiculous. I want Jeff to be here. He's not even here. Oh, goodness. Wait, maybe he's on the roof. Sometimes he... Well, actually, he's never been on the roof, but I know I like being on the roof. So let's go up. Oh, Jeff, are you here? Jeffy boy! Jeffy... Oh, you are here. Hey, hey, Jeff, what's going on? Uh, baby duck here. Yeah, I, I kind of rented a rug place. Desperate Dan really gave me some terrible, terrible house directions, but... You say you know where my brother's real house is? Oh, gosh, I don't know if I believe you, Jeff, but do you actually know where he lives? Yeah, kid, of course I know where he lives. I wouldn't have called you here if I didn't know where he was. Jeez. Ah, uh, yeah, so I got his address here. Now, I, I actually texted to you in case you didn't want to come home because you didn't answer your phone. But, uh, yeah, turns out, kid, you, uh, you gotta learn to answer your phone. But So you should have the address on your phone, but that's definitely where your brother lives. I know that for a fact, hey? Are you excited to finally meet your twin brother? That's gonna be pretty weird for you, baby duck. What, what, what's gonna happen? What, what if he doesn't like you? Ooh, what if he beats you up? What if he's bigger and stronger than you? Ah! <laughs> Jeff, you are hilarious. Bigger and stronger than me. Oh, gosh, Jeff, if you just met me, I am an absolute unit. Oh, goodness, I am super, super strong. Oh my gosh, how dare you think he's bigger and stronger me? He's not gonna beat me off. But hey, that's good that I have the address there, Jeff. Oh, I'm super nervous. I gotta go meet my mommy. I gotta meet him. Oh, there's so many people I have to meet this week. And I kinda thought my dad might have been lying to me when he told me about him. Because, oh, you should have seen the place that I went to. Oh, it was ridiculous. It was disgusting. But that's what I get for trusting Desperate Dan. That was kind of my own fault, Jeff. Yeah, kid, that, that's definitely your fault. Why would you trust Desperate Dan like that, huh? Who who does that? What kind of weirdo trusts Desperate Dan with some important information, huh? But, uh, kid, yeah, I wouldn't be too worried about it. You know, there's a lot that you need to do here. To... Okay, look, kid, we're wasting a lot of time here. Why don't you just go see your twin brother? You're wasting your time talking to me. You have his address. Go talk to him now, baby duck. Don't waste any more time. Just go see your new brother, and you're gonna be super happy, I promise. Yeah, Jeff, you're right. I am just wasting time, but I'm just so nervous. But I guess next stop I get is gonna be my brother's place. I, I suppose I do have to go meet him now, so... Okay, Jeff, I'll see you later, buddy. It was good talking to you. Oh, gosh, Jeff is right. I was just procrastinating meeting my brother because I'm so nervous. I mean, what if he doesn't like me? I can't, I can't handle another brother not liking me. Oh, oh not another brother, another family member. Not that I have ever really had family members. Oh, this is so strange getting this new family. I don't know if I like it at all, but come on, baby duck. I guess it's time to go meet your new brother. <laughs> yep. Dan! Dan! Yes, it's Baby Duck! What? No! I am not ringing to say yes, I want to come to dinner. I bring it to give out to you. But why wouldn't I give out to you? You sent me to the wrong address. You sent me to some stinky place. Oh, it was disgusting, Dad. I was stuck there for so long. It was horrible. Oh, my gosh. It was disgusting. 
It was the most horrible place in the world, and you sent me there. Well, no, thankfully Jeff found a new place that I can go to. Well, he said it's... He, Jeff said he thinks this is this house, so I guess I, I trust Jeff. Well, a lot more than I trust you. Well, how could I trust you? Oh, you are so stupid. Well, well, look, Desperate Dan, I've got to go. I have some business to attend to, and I have to go see my brother, okay? So goodbye. Goodness, he is so stupid, that Desperate Dan. Okay, so my brother says, if I look at the address... It, wait, it, this is it here. It has some smoke on top of it. Whoa, this is his place? This is disgusting, yucky. Well, I don't think I really like his place at all very much. Uh, oh, this is, he doesn't have a back garden or anything. There's nothing at the back for him. Hmm. Okay, I don't think I like this very much. In fact, I know I don't like this very much. There's a lamp and all in the way. Oh, baby duck. Maybe your brother's weird. Uh, you don't even have a doorbell. Man. I'm just going in. I don't care. I'm just going to go into his house. Hello? Hello? Ooh. What is that thing? Why has he got a skeleton in his kitchen as well? It's a floating L heads. Wow! So it's confirmed! My brother is a freak! Oh, that's great. I'm so happy. He's a weirdo. Okay, let me check around. I guess this is uh this is a pretty normal sitting room. Oh, nope, this isn't a normal living room. Look at it, look at the skulls up here. That's the opposite of a normal living room. What is wrong with him? I'm telling you, baby duck, your family just get weirder and weirder as the time goes on. I guess does that I could have a look and see if there's any other rooms. Oh, the doors shut themselves. Okay. Wow, sheesh. Oh, oh, great, more floating L skulls. What? What is wrong with my brother? Oh, let me check. Oh, a toy room. Wait a second. Does he have children? Ooh, he could have children. Well, at least there's a toy room here. I guess that's half the battle. I guess that's kind of good that he has toys and he's, he's albeit a little bit normal. Oh, gosh. Let me check around. Is there, is there any... Uh, hello? Hello, brother? Brother, it's your... Oh, my goodness. There's blood. There's blood that... Oh, this place is absolutely disgusting. What? Oh, oh, great. More floating things. More floating heads and potions. What? What is my brother up to? Oh, he, at least he has a table and a lamp, I guess. Uh, wait, there's three rooms in this place. Where does he sleep? Nah, baby, look, this can't be my brother's house. My, why would my brother want to live in a place like this? This is just super, super weird. I'm not really... Ill. Oh, baby, duck, this is the creepiest... This is definitely the creepiest place I have ever been. That is without a doubt. I'm gonna lie down for a minute because this is just disgust. Oh, oh no, baby duck. It's hiding here. I, I think. Oh no, baby duck. There's somebody coming into the house. Oh gosh, you better hide here, buddy. Creepy weird. Wait, you look just like me. 